What's up guys, Jacob Owens here for the Buff Nerds and today I'm going to talk to you guys about how to do speed ramping effects in Adobe Premiere for your videos. So with a lot of my videos and music videos, I pretty much always have some sort of speed ramping effect going on. Whether it's slow and then speeds up or it's fast and then slows down. And the point of how I achieve this is by shooting everything in slow motion. Pretty much all of my videos, whether it's a music video or a travel video, I'm always shooting in some form of slow motion. Rarely am I ever shooting at 24 frames a second. I'm usually shooting at 60 frames a second, 72 frames a second, 120 frames a second, because you always have the opportunity to slow the footage down or speed it up. So I'm gonna jump over to the computer and get into the tutorial of how to speed ramp your footage all right, so we're gonna get right into the tutorial here. So when it comes to speed ramping and speed warping and what I do for all my videos, um, first to do that, your clip has to be shot in slow motion. So right here we have a clip from the futuristic Do It video. This clip was shot in I believe 48 frames a second. Um, so here I sped up the clip uh, 200% so that it would be in sync with the lyrics. And now what I'm going to do is um, when you're you know, controlling speed warping or, or ramping and you're going to slow clip down and speed it up, you always want to do it to a certain beat within the music. Have the, the edit be influenced by something. So right here when the beat kicks in, we're going to take that marker where the beat drops right here. You can even see it in the audio. We're going to cut that. And now what we're going to do, because it's a slow-mo clip, we're going to send it back to its original you know, 100% slow-mo form. And now what's gonna happen is right on that cut, the clip is gonna slow down. And then we'll bring it right back in when the next beat comes back in. So right here on this clap, we're gonna make another cut, and we're gonna send it back to 200% so that it speeds back up. So that's pretty much in my music videos and even in my travel films and different videos how I speed and slow down clips just with a simple cut on a beat slow it down when the next beat comes back in speed it back up vice versa you know if I wanted to send this one into fast motion I could make it 500% so that when it comes back in you know it speeds back up now another example is here on Lexi shaking the shaking our groove thing over here. We're gonna make a cut on the beat. So right here, there's a good little beat. We're gonna take this. This clip I believe was shot in like 120 frames a second. So you can see I have this clip sped up 600% to uh, not be in slow-mo. And then right when that beat happens, we're gonna again Command J if you're in Adobe Premiere, and you're gonna send that clip back to its normal 100% slow-mo form. And now it's gonna, on that beat, boom, cut into slow-mo. So you can see that there, just normal, boom. And then here on the clap, we'll bring it back in. Right here, we'll make a cut to the beat of the music and we'll send it back to 600%. So now we have this regular to slow-mo to regular. Or we can as well cut to the beat. Right there we cut on the clap. Um, now we can cut to the bass because over here we cut to the bass. So let's see here. So right here, here's the bass hit or the beat drop. And we're gonna go back to 600%. And again, here you go. So you can see that, pretty simple. Um, that's pretty much how I affect all of my, um, you know, speed ramping clips by just a simple um, cut, increase the speed of the clip, decrease the speed of the clip, you know, um, send it to 500%, 600%, 1000%, but that's all you really need to do when you're speed ramping clips. That's what I do for my music videos, my travel films. I just simply cut to the beat of the music. I'll take that clip and either speed it up or slow it down, um, depending on what effect I want to give. 
and that's really it. So when it comes to speed ramping, it's as simple as basically a cut and the change of the clip speed. So yeah, hopefully this uh, helped you guys learn a little bit of information on you know how I speed ramp my clips and how you can speed ramp your clips, whether you're doing a music video or just a travel film or whatever it is that you're shooting and editing. If you like the video, please leave a thumbs up, like, subscribe, comment below. You know, let me know if there's any other topics you want to see me cover when it comes to editing or just shooting in general. Appreciate you guys for watching, and until next time, peace.